I'm Vip Hasavaratnam. I'm a student of India Dance Wales and my teacher is Kiran Ratna, who's also my mother. And she's won an award, isn't yeah. she? Yeah, and she won a Distinguished Teachers Award from the Lapfest just a few months ago. How long have you been dancing? Um, I've grown up with dance all around me since forever, really, but I think I started going to class when I was about four. And when did you do your art engagement? Two years ago, in 2008. So tell us about the preparation of that. Um, well, I did it at the end of my summer holidays. So throughout the past two years, um, I started doing extra lessons for my own get room and learning the new items and things. And then the summer holidays leading up to it, I did a lot more practice, a lot of rehearsals. And then two weeks before, the musicians came from India and then we had rehearsals with them for two weeks. And how was it? It was, it was really surreal, just the opportunity to do a solo performance by an entire show is, just never happens and the opportunity to perform with live musicians also never happens, so the opportunity to do a whole show with live musicians was just amazing. Were you very stressed by it? Um, I don't think I was, it's the kind of thing that's so crazy that you just take it in your stride and then after it's over you just think what just happened <laughs> how did you prepare for it um in terms of your costume and things like that um well i had costumes already we did get one new costume just because it would be nice to have an erangitram costume and i got it the same colours and stuff as my first ever costume and then I opened the show in that one and stuff and I just thought that would be quite nice but other than that we just used what I had. And do you dance a lot now? Yeah I still do. I'm in university now but I still practice um, when I'm away and then when I come back for the holidays I do a lot and when even in uni I try to get involved with any performances and events that I can. Will you continue doing this? Yeah, definitely. I don't think I'd be able to live without it. <laughs> you have a sister or brother? I have an older brother. Okay. Is he involved as well? Um, he used to learn when he was younger and he knows a lot about dance and he always comes to shows and things. What do you actually dance in your island Um, I did a bush banjali. Um, um, a lot of the items I did the same as what my mother did for hers, just because we thought that would be nice. And a lot of them were also composed by Sri Theron Masterji, um, so they're not very well known. <laughs> but um, I did I did the same Varnam as my mother, um, and that was composed by Sri Theron Masterji. And only me and my mother and her teacher have ever done it, so it's like a really special Varnam, so that was nice. And then I did two expressional items that my mum did for hers, and two that we'd learnt a few years earlier. We'd gone to India to learn from my mum's teacher's teacher, so I did two items that we learnt there. And then I did Dhanashi Thilana, which I've known since I was really little. It's always been my favourite. <laughs> Where did you go in India? Um, my mum's teacher's teacher lives in Mangalore, so we went there. And whenever we go, we always go to Chennai for a bit for dance shopping. <laughs> <laughs> What's dance shopping? Um, costumes, jewellery, flowers, just everything. <laughs> Where did you do your art engagement? It just seemed like that was always going to happen. Um, especially like growing up around it and seeing others do their art engagements around me. It was always like, wow, I would love to do one of those. And then once I got older, my mum started saying to me, like, you know, when, when would you want to do that? You can do that sometime. And 
I, as I said, the opportunity to perform with live musicians, it, it just never happens. So when you have an opportunity like that, you're going to grab it. And where did you do it? In the riverfront in Newport. Was it a big theatre? Um, yeah, it was quite big. It had a really nice big stage. And um, I can't remember why, but we'd seen it before and we thought it would be a really nice venue. So did you have lots of food after? Um, yeah, we did. We had some buffet. And, yeah.